Old Swan is about two and a half miles from the pier head. It's on the main Prescott Liverpool Road, and if you're not careful and all the lights are on green, you pass through it in about three seconds. Old Swan is an area of four and a half square miles of very densely populated housing. There is only four and a quarter acres of actual open space. The idea of a festival came from a public meeting that was held in Old Swan regarding the facilities for young people and the effect of vandalism in the area. A decision was made to hold a community festival where we hoped we would once again bridge the gap between the young people and the old people, between families and between neighbours. The first meeting was in fact possibly most well attended. Afterwards we found that it was then left to the same hardcore people, little shopkeeper, bus driver and a few local mums to organise the whole festival. We decided to have a big public meeting but we found this somewhat limiting. It was alright as a PR job of putting the idea over but it was very little help in concrete ideas and we decided on a very basic framework of having a big parade to start it. Most of the street parties on the Sunday, theatre activities, outdoor activities, pub activities, musical evenings and more street parties through the week ending with a big finale of the medieval battle on the final Saturday. The police said that all music has got to stop by nine o'clock. We might have it changed by then, but legally, due to a law made in 1832, I think, all street noise must stop at nine o'clock. Play on Wheels, a local group from Liverpool, came along the Saturday before the festival started. They set up their inflatables, and a few kids came along, and then more, and then more, until soon the whole field was alive. It's very easy on inflatables with a lot of kids, when they've got big boots on, to crack somebody else over the head, and you can come away with quite a nasty injury. Before kids went on inflatables, they had to let go of their shoes. This in turn caused a bit of a problem. I think I managed to lose one pair of shoes by having to give them to a kid who lost his pair and his mother was going to belt him around the head. Uh, we, so we've still got one pair of shoes lost in old swan somewhere.
what we hoped to achieve was a cavalcade of colour through both streets, 51 weeks of the year. It was quite humdrum, dirty, filthy, mucky, wet, rainy, and not at all interesting. But then on one week of the year, there was this splash and explosion of colour and noise. Action Space are a London-based group. Their community art that they performed was somewhat weird and wonderful, and I'm not sure whether Old Swan was quite ready for it yet. And in fact, on one occasion, during a street party, Action Space dressed up as Arabs and, and Gypsies, and the locals called me up to say that there's <laughs> vagabonds and Gypsies hanging around the street, and could we get rid of them as they're spoiling the street party? So, you know, one had to reply, well, we've paid £400 for them, <laughs> so you'll jolly well enjoy them.